Blackpink breaks a Guinness World Record, Lil Nas X celebrates his coming out anniversary, and Ty Dolla Sign teams up with Kanye West. These are your top Billboard stories for Wednesday, July 1st. How you like that? Alright, first up, Blackpink's historic week has been rewarded with a swag of Guinness World Records. The K-pop girl group's music video for their latest single, How You Like That, earned 86.3 million views, setting a record for most viewed YouTube video in 24 hours, most viewed music video in 24 hours, and most viewed YouTube music video in 24 hours by a K-pop group. But that's not all. The live premiere of How You Like That reached 1.66 million peak concurrent viewers on the streaming video platform, setting new records for most viewers for the premiere of a video on YouTube and most viewers for the premiere of a music video on YouTube. And according to Guinness World Records, Blackpink already holds the record for most followed female group on Spotify and music group with the most subscribers on YouTube, eclipsing One Direction. It's always what you like. Next up, Lil Nas X took a walk down Pride memory lane. Here's Jordan Rowling with that story. Resharing his June 30th, 2019 coming out tweet that featured an animated video for his song Closure You Like and the message, some of y'all already know, some of y'all don't care, some of y'all not gonna f*** with me no more. But before this month ends, I want y'all to listen closely to Closure. Well, this year, the Old Town Road rapper was way more direct, asking his 5 million Twitter followers, I have officially been gay for a year. Wow, that was fun. What should I do next? Murdered my ego when you walked away and last but certainly not least, Ty Dolla Sign just dropped his new single, Ego Death, that not only features the one and only Kanye West, but also FKA Twigs and Skrillex. Wait, 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 it been bad. Showing up to the Grammys mad. Trying to win some we already had. All right, that's all for today. But for more on these stories, you can head to Billboard.com. And until next time, for Billboard News, I'm Chelsea Briggs. 